Happy Valentine's Day to you all. So this video is going to be a creative feel video. I haven't done one in a while now. Um, and I had actually done a video like last week. But I was trying to delete some stuff off my camera. And everything that I had and was going to upload got deleted. So... I am coming to you all today to show you all some things that I have done in my spare time. Some things that um, I was inspired to do. So, the first thing I want to share with you all is a jewelry piece. It's very simple. Um, I wish I had the beads that I wanted and I didn't think about it until afterwards. But I think I'm going to keep this like it is. I was going to add some beads on the sides of it and have it going all the way around. Um, I might do another, get another accent piece like this and do that. But I think I want to leave this one plain like it is. So it's just a pink um, accent piece that I just put on to a chain. Um... So, yeah. And the next two things that I have to show you all. Um, the first one that I have, I've actually had done since like the beginning or middle of January. Um, from all of this, uh, well, what little bit of winter mix that we had um, here in North Carolina. Um some places got more snow than others and things like that. Um, here where I live, we got more sleet and rain. A little bit of snow. Not much to, you know, cover the ground and things like that. Um, but I know um, my hometown, they got more snow than anything. We had nothing but just sleet and a little um bit of snow but this was something that i did here um i was experimenting with my some knives that i had for a painting and so i did some mountains and then i did this little shed slash outhouse thing and I just kind of threw some evergreens in there and wanted to make it look like, you know, there was snow just everywhere. So, this is the painting and I'm going to show you all a close-up of it. So, yeah. That's everything there. Then the next one I was inspired to do because... Valentine's Day was coming up and today is actually Valentine's Day so again happy Valentine's Day to you all and I hope you all have had a wonderful day or will have a wonderful day, wonderful day. So this was my Valentine's Day inspired painting. Um, I just kind of did my own thing with this. I don't really know like where it came from really um i love the roses they're not the best roses that i probably could do but i love them i had to watch a tutorial like 500 times to make these roses and i kind of had to go back over um like after the paint dried a little bit and kind of clean up some areas but um, I did finally get it and I think that came out pretty good. I want to learn how to put my leaves on a little bit better because they didn't come out, um, like I really wanted them to. So, yeah. But that's my Valentine's Day, um, painting there. And I do have some thorns 
on some of my roses and on my vines here and have some hearts purple white and pink and red hearts they're just floating around around this big heart here so that's that and the next one I will have to take you all into the next area I actually had done for a couple of weeks now and purchased it out of Walmart because one it was it was only just five dollars but we got it because it was something that I needed you know um, and that is the key holder there so what I did was it already came you know carved out and with the um, holders there it already came that way um, with those three black holders on it um, but the only thing I did to it was just paint it I painted it black and that is some metallic black paint probably can't see it that good but it is some metallic um, black paint I don't know if you can see it that well if I can be a little still but anyways um I tend to misplace my keys and my husband saw it and he grabbed it. So I um I have stuff falling in the background but anyways he saw it and he you know picked it up and um like I said I just painted it because I really needed somewhere to put my keys at because I misplace my keys all of the time. Um, there is not a day that I not leave or misplace my keys. So, um, that was really, you know, neat and thoughtful of him. And, um, I guess that's pretty much it for Creative View. That's all I've done so far. Um, I had a bracelet that I was trying to make, but I've misplaced that. And, yeah, I'm going to tell you, like, I really, really need to get on top of organizing. You know, I organize one thing and then something else gets unorganized, so... I really need to get on top of that. But um, I will talk to you guys later and you all have a blessed day.